everyone, Stormy Strike here, and this is an unboxing video I actually filmed all the way back in February of this year that I meant to release sooner, but just never got around to it. Considering the contents that I'm unboxing, this video is great for Halloween, though. This is an order from Mel Miller Equine Art I did back when she was having a Halloween medallion's second sale. Inside the box, she included these wonderful stickers and a little info sheet about the medallions. I bought three medallions from this sale, and then I also have two more medallions of hers that I purchased in the past that I will also be showing in this video. First up is a fun purple-pinkish medallion done in translucent resin that has a little touch of glitter in there. And of course, perhaps the most noticeable part of this are the beautiful white bones inside this medallion. It is so cool, and again, a perfect thing to show off for the Halloween season. By the way, this particular medallion mold is called Wraith. Next up is another medallion with beautiful white bones showing, this time on Mel Miller's Uldric mold. The resin is a translucent smoky gray, also with some glitter, and it is just gorgeous. Absolutely stunning, and something that's neat is that the back of this medallion is just as beautiful as the front, at least in my opinion. You can really see those awesome bones in there. The third medallion from this box is another Uldric medallion. This one does not have bones, but does have a unicorn horn. This beautiful matching unicorn horn is removable, so this piece can be displayed with or without the horn. The colors on this medallion are just beyond stunning. It has beautiful shiny and translucent green hair, and then the body has this very cool holographic kind of paint effect on it. Don't even know how to describe it. It is just amazing, and the camera does not do it enough justice. Now for the Mel Miller Halloween medallions I got before this particular order. This is the first one I ever got, which is another Wraith medallion. There is no bones in this one, but it is framed against the image of a sort of silver-colored moon. The other Wraith also does have a moon behind it, but it's not as noticeable as this one that has the color on it. The horse itself is this beautiful, shimmery, kind of iridescent, I honestly don't know how to describe the effect on this color but it is absolutely beautiful and haunting, kind of like a spooky ghost. Lastly is yet another Wraith medallion, but this is the vampire bat version. This one is done in translucent smoky gray and has silver bones inside. You can even see the metallic of the silver bones through the resin, and it is just a really wild look. A fun detail, too, is that this one does have vampire fangs. I also love the added bones for the wings. And there are all five of my Halloween Mel Miller medallions together. I am just absolutely in love with all of them. They are incredible, and if Mel Miller sells more Halloween medallions like these again in the future, I'm sure I will probably be picking up at least one more. Do you have a favorite of these five? Do you happen to own your own medallion like one of these? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful Halloween season. Bye everyone!